What happens when you're a member of Congress and you mistreat your staff? They record you and release it to the media. Yeah, here's Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee sounding off. And you've been warned. Language. Uh, you took a piece of paper from that woman uh, regarding uh, something that was owed by Duncan Tell. Where is it? What, what date was it? All from yes. Jerome took it up, sir. I have to call him to pick it up when I switched out the picture. <laughs> I'll call him. I, I don't want you to do a goddamn thing. I want you to have a fucking brain. I want you to have read it. I want you to say, Congresswoman, it was such and such date. That's what I want. That's the kind of staff that I want to have. So some stupid other motherfucker did it. You, and, and I don't have the information. Nobody sent me the information. I need to uh, ensure my uh, schedule. And, uh, you know, if, if Boo Boo did it, shit ass did it, fuck face did it. And nobody knows a goddamn thing in my office. Okay? Nothing. I gave it to you. Your job was to get it on the calendar, imprint it in your brain, or send me the information back saying, Congresswoman, I made sure that the Ovi Duncan Tell event that you gave me uh, for so-and-so date at 7 is on the fucking calendar. Not to hold Jerome has it. Okay? So when I called Jerome, he only sitting up there like a fat ass, just an idiot, talking about uh, what the fuck he doesn't know. Okay? Both of y'all are fuck up a fucking F. It's the worst shit that I could have ever had put together. Two goddamn big ass children. Fucking idiots. Serve no goddamn purpose. Ain't managing nobody. Nobody's respecting them. Nobody gives a shit about what you're doing. And you ain't doing shit. And this is an example of it. I gave it to you wrong. This is not child's work. Okay? Yeah, it's absolutely child's work. I think you proved that with this audio clip. But nothing out of the ordinary. This is typical Democrat behavior in 2023. Between Senator Joshua Miller keying a citizen's vehicle for no reason other than the citizen having an anti-Biden bumper sticker on the back, to Jamal Bowman pulling a fire alarm to delay a vote, well, this is par for the course. But let me know what you think about Sheila's behavior in the comments, and if you enjoyed the video, be sure to follow.